150 watt extraction from the ringer. Oh, I'm sorry, 145 watts. Ringer is running tough. Favorite quote. Voltage, loads being powered from the ringer. We can hear the ticking, radiant energy still present on the system. Ringer is powered up. Here's our voltage. Fighting the, uh, each tick is fighting the voltage drain of our heavy loads. If I disconnect these loads, our voltage will immediately surge back up to uh, 1415. Super caps are the key to it. Improve the ticking. And, uh, yeah. It's getting wild. I'll shut this off. The inverter. You'll immediately see our voltage skyrocket back up. So again, on. Voltage drops. Try and get that in frame. Off. Voltage just pounds back up to full. On. Voltage drops a bit. Off. Pounds back up to full. So, the ringer is almost perfected. Made the cap bank a little bit bigger. made out of all these capacitors. Right here, I order them in bulk. They're uh, 63 volt, 10,000 UF, so that's that. And yeah, we're pretty much full charge, so the ringer can do work, baby. The ringer can do work, and it's all self-looped upon itself the ringer. The key is proper circuit isolation when you self-loop it. You have to have isolation components when you self-loop it. No physical contact between circuitry. It has to be a wireless transfer. Kind of like an isolation transformer. So that's that and stay tuned. Once again I'll switch the inverter on. Here we go. 145 watt draw each pulse of the ringer, you can see the light flicker. I'm gonna back up, maybe you can see that better. The ringer is making the loads flicker. Hopefully that captures on camera, but the, each pulse is the load flickers. There's our voltage. Big heat light connected. Very cheap way of making power. So, that's the ringer, guys. Ladies and gents, that's the ringer. I've got no power in this area of my room. Um, the power stops right here from my home grid. Power stops right there. My fan's the last thing that's on. Everything past this point is all self-contained and the ringer circuitry is running itself. Key was the huge cap bank. 141 watt pull. And we can see, uh, see it twitching, or the load is pulsing with each ring. And we're fighting the voltage drop with each tick. See that needle twitching? Shut you off. And we immediately surge back up to full charge via those high pulse ticks. So, that's the ringer. It's getting very refined. Stay tuned.